What is up everyone and welcome back to more Naruto Shippuden. I am here with my reaction to episode 488. Now apologies for a lack of video the other day. I was feeling pretty unwell that day so I had a day in bed, no makeup, no nothing but pizza. There was a lot of pizza. Stijo went and got me a Domino's pizza so I was like yeah. So it was pretty good actually to just stay in bed. I felt like I just needed it, you know? But I am back to it today. Now we've got a couple more episodes of this little Sasuke arc and then we are moving on to a Shikamaru arc. Then it's the finale and then we are starting a brand new series. As I say, I've already started watching the brand new series. It is phenomenal, by the way. I am so excited. I feel like these episodes, like, in comparison to what I am now reacting to, I'm just like, these are okay, but I just want to share this other show so bad because it's just so much better than these wind down episodes. Like these are good, but there is a huge part of me that was like, I wish I just watched them off screen, you know, just kind of end Naruto and move on to something else. Like these are good, don't get me wrong, but just compared to what I have recently started watching, it's like a big, big difference. But anyways, the more I talk, the less I get through them. So let's just get on with this. Don't forget if you want to watch them before they get to YouTube to head on over to my website, suzilu.co.uk and become a VIP member. I'm so excited to share next week with you guys what the next show is going to be. So many of you have predicted correctly, which makes me more excited because it's like, it's obviously something you guys really want to see anyway. Don't forget though, I always, always react to shows in English because that's my main language. I don't care that there's people that prefer screaming Japanese people in their ear. I'm not one of these people, okay? I much prefer watching shows in my language because I get a better understanding. I don't want to have to sit there and read and then miss the animation. I just want to take it all in and listen to what they're saying. So every show I ever do will be in English. You guys should know this by now anyway. All right, 488, let's do it. You were gonna use your Ketsuryugan to get revenge against the Uchiha who forced the Chinoike clan to Hell Valley. <clears throat> so I was your target from the very start. If I sent exploding humans to the Leaf Village, I figured you'd be sure to go back. I plan to kill you along with the entire Leaf. I mean, can we be honest for a second here? What makes her think that even for a second that she could take out Sasuke? And in case you couldn't kill me, you even asked an old partner to stand by and pretend to be Fushi. <laughs> well then, are you gonna kill me now? Yes, we are! So let's put everything on the line and fight to the death. Sorry, but I'm not interested in doing that. Hmm. You're the same as usual. I don't think that you're gonna have much of a choice, because I reckon she's gonna attack us anyway. Using our blood, the Chinuike clan can make use of all kinds of jutsu. How do you not die from doing that? You should be dead. I don't know, maybe I'm giving Sasuke too much credit here, but I just feel like there's really not many people that can go up against him now. though I'll give him that isn't it interesting though that Sasuke doesn't want to kill anymore though girl you need to just give it up give it up you want to keep going <laughs> chakras entering my wound My chakra seals the wound, and then lies in wait. Lies in wait? Isn't it obvious? <laughs> oh, shoot! Could you imagine if this was the end of Sasuke? Oh my gosh, after everything that happened. Oh. 
I love that it's playing Orochimaru's theme because I remember anytime we dealt with Orochimaru, this was the music we got. So that's how you made the exploding humans. The shotting gun? Did you really think you stood a chance, girl? I was so incredibly jealous of you, Sasuke. Being born in the Hidden Leaf, bearing the Uchiha name, and having a family that loved you. You became infamous after you left your village, but now you're still able to travel freely. That you've always, always, always been loved by someone. There was always people like that around you, but not me. I've always been alone. It's so interesting to me that she's led a life very similar to Sasuke, but if anything, worse than him. How can you fight for the leaf? Because I'm alive. What's that mean? I have a friend who saved me. A friend who can share my pain. And I with him. Well then surely we can just be her friend and we can save her from this darkness. But we've come this far. Maybe you should join the leaf. The light this world is gazing at. Up ahead. <sighs> That's the thing, you have someone that cares for you. Why would you want to die? He cares for you. Fushi! why did you come here? Fushi? I have a friend who saved me. A friend who can share my pain, and I with him. Exactly, you have a friend! He's right behind you! So you're not even alone. Kill someone, kill me. <sighs> He's not gonna kill any of you, but you need to change. It's really okay. God, I just love the messages that we get in Naruto. Just about like, all you need in your life is that one person. You don't need to have tons of people around you, that would be great. But to have that relationship with just one person, it will fill the hole in your heart. I want to see the future you talked about. I want to see that new world. <laughs> oh my gosh, so are they going to come to the Leaf Village? Then again, I don't even know if Sasuke will return to the Leaf Village or not. There's no more foreign chakra circulating inside him now. See, there was some comments from the first episode of this Sasuke saga, whatever you want to call it, that Hinata was pregnant. Obviously, it's not told us anything about that just now. Well, hello. I'm the one behind all this. I take full responsibility for everything. So please, I want you to be lenient with these guys. No, that isn't what we want, Shino. Yeah, th the truth is, I discussed it with the Mizukage of the Land of Mist, and she wants to take you in. Well, why would she? Because now's the only time to stop the chain of negativity. Oh. Please, come in. Good lord, can we please stop? This chain of negativity in the real world as well. Why, why is it people like being negative so much? I wish I knew. You must atone for what you did. And doing that will take the rest of your lives. But then, every shinobi, great or small, has to bear the very same burden. And I'm no different. I love Kakashi so, so much. I just do. <laughs> right about now, he should be... Coliseum? What? No way! I 
will fully welcome all challenges, and I will free all the shinobi here. If you want the Uchiha's eye, come and get it. <gasps> Sasuke's... He's so good now! Like, it's almost hard to accept. I think Sasuke is doing this for your sake, so he would never, ever lose. So are you Sasuke's? Hmm? Yeah, I'm his friend. My name's Naruto Uzumaki. <laughs> that friend of yours saved me from the darkness. I'm very grateful. And Naruto saved Sasuke from the darkness. So I feel like it all comes back to Naruto anyway. I love it. I love this new side to Sasuke. So now, what happens to us? The hidden cloud will take you in. The cloud will? Yes, indeed. We of the hidden cloud will safeguard all of you, Shinobi. Oh my god, this is so nice, though. It's like all of the villages coming together to do what's right for the people. And all you rich folk can get in jail. You really should be thanking your Lord Sixth. He came and insisted that since this island was close to my village, it was the Cloud's business to deal with it. That's the reason why we're here. So dull. Long ago, for your sake, Naruto bowed to me in the snow and fiercely argued for you. It was when you abducted my kid brother, B, and Danzo agreed to my request to eliminate you as a rogue ninja. Naruto has literally been saving Sasuke's tail since, like, day one. Like, isn't it crazy? He really is the best friend that anyone could have. Know yourself and know other people too. And don't mistake your path again. Understand what it means that you're allowed to walk freely in this world now. And create a reason for others to accept that. I never thought I would see the day, actually, that Sasuke was able to just leave all his crimes behind and be free. Oh, they didn't get you. Well, I'm here, aren't I? All according to plan, I suppose. That's right, thanks to you. Mm. Orochi, what are you doing? So all of the little squabbles build up and you start hating each other. In the end, you're at each other's throats. That sounds just like the Uchiha clan. Yes, they were definitely like that. However, that's the truth of the Chinoike clan. Oh! So that's why you killed your entire clan. <laughs> Even still, my daughter was surprisingly adorable. You witnessed the foolish things that your dear daughter was doing in the Colosseum. Is that why you gave up on acquiring Sasuke? Wait, that was his daughter? And it was nothing to do with the Uchihas whatsoever. He killed the clan and then framed the Uchihas. What? There are guys out there who are doing terrible things, like what just happened. But I guess that it all works out in the end. If there are guys like Sasuke to counter them. Huh? What's up, Sakura? You seem kind of happy. Huh? <laughs> With what just happened, I know Sasuke is definitely trying extremely hard to accomplish all of that. <laughs> That's it. At least now you've had the confirmation that you know that he really is doing his best. Just forget that I said anything, you understand? <laughs> so wait a minute! You speak out loud! That you have a thing for Sasuke, which everybody knows, and then you punch Naruto? Like, you're so mean. Must be from Kakashi. I love the way he says Kakashi. Kakashi. It's Naruto. Sasuke, you may not be back in the village right now, but you're still protecting it. You're just like a one-man leaf police force. I love the fact, though, that we have a way to be able to contact Sasuke, so he's not completely out of reach. I like that. I'll go home. Oh my god, yes! Go back to the leaf, please! 
So I wonder if that is the end of the Sasuke section. It definitely felt fillerish. I know that technically it wasn't filler and it did refer back to a lot of the main story stuff, but it still had a filler vibe to it. But it was nice to get to spend a bit more time with Sasuke, see what he's doing after the war, things like that. And yeah, I still ship. Sasuke and Sakura I don't give a damn what anybody says that's how I feel and if he's on his way back home now to the leaf village then can we make it happen please please I guess time will tell thank you so much for watching my reaction to this episode and I'll see you all in the next one bye